capacity. So for those who don't know what carrying capacity is, it's basically the amount of space that's possible to support a living organism. So carrying capacity is like how many organisms can live in the area or the region that they are based on the amount of resources available to them before they reach a limit and they start to die off. So my question is, are humans at carrying capacity? How would we know? And here's, here's a little background. Some experts say yes and some experts say no. The experts that say yes, that we are at carrying capacity are looking at it from the traditional standpoint of how much space do we have to support the number of organisms. And the experts that say no say that we actually have the technology to be able to support a greater number of humans in the regions that we live because of technological advances, advancements, um, and the ability to like, you know, remove carbon dioxide from the atmosphere. And there are a lot of ideas on how to do that. Actually, I was surprised. They've pretty much already figured out um, a few different ways to extract carbon dioxide from the atmosphere, but there's some like limitations to each idea. But if we were to apply like a, you know, variable amount of these ideas, we could do it. So my question to you guys is, do you think that humans are at carrying capacity and should we start to consider how to sustain the number of population that we are currently at and how should we approach that?